Hey guys, it's Betty Glasgow here once again. Welcome back to my channel. This video um, is going to be about Paige and her injury um, and what's going on there. Now, I have not watched Raw for the last couple weeks. Um, I have it taped. I have not watched SmackDown. I have it taped. Got to binge watch it for today. Um, but I've been watching closely um, because during a live event a few weeks back, Paige got injured with a kick from behind by Sasha Banks. I've seen the video. Um, and he clearly tells she got injured. Um, it's for real. It's not kayfabe. Um, people are saying she suffered a stinger. Which is where, you know, we all know Steve Austin got a stinger along with a broken neck. Um, it's where your nerves and your fingers and your body and your extremities go haywire. And you, you can't feel them. I'm now saying that she may not be cleared to ever wrestle again. She may be forced into retirement. We remember seeing Edge with this. And here's what's sad. She spent over a year trying to come back from injury. And she, you know, I'll give her credit. If she really did it, was she beat back demons in her life to come back to wrestle. To, in a, in my fucking opinion, and, and you know it is, my opinion, I know a lot of people out there like it, to a shit, piss, poor story line. They didn't use her well, in my opinion. And that's a problem. She could have went out on a high. And I hope she's okay. I hope she's able to wrestle again so they can fucking fix this problem with her. Um, but even if she's in injured and she can't wrestle, talk is that she might just be fall into a managerial role. But right now, her it looks like her Royal Rumble spot is out, so now they're going to bring someone else out. Um, going to be interested to find out who they do it with. Um. But again, I will, in the future, I'll make a bunch of videos of how the WWE fucked up the last half of the year. Now, I would roll into these theories. I just don't have the time to do it right now. They're just going to be too long, too many. Um, but right now, we see that Paige is probably going to be having to be forced to retire as an active wrestler, um, which is a shame. I hope, I hope I'm wrong. I hope the reports are wrong. I hope she can still wrestle because she is a good wrestler. Um, but hopefully it's good to know that they are thinking that if worst case scenario, she can at least be a manager, manager, which is okay. I mean, granted, it's probably not going to be the, what she wants in life as being in the ring, but at least for her body, it's the best. You know, that way she don't have to do the wear and tear. She'll have a longer career, she'll have a longer life, um, but at, at her age, she's still pretty young. Um, again, it's sad news, but I, God, WWE just fucking make better stories. Uh, I'll get to that another later, but I just, that's the news. Um, sad. Again, but I'm pulling for you, Pedro. I'm hoping you aren't hurt. I really, I mean, as bad as they're saying, I do hope that you have a good recovery. And even if you can't wrestle, that you stay. Do take the managerial role. Uh, you, you're good. Okay, I might be hard on you. I've done some hard videos on you, but that's for the best. All right, you guys, tell me what you think. Go down, like, dislike, comment, and subscribe. And as always, you guys, take care. And I'll see you all next time.